Hello and welcome to this video. Today I'm going to explain how easily it is to create a blog using artificial intelligence, in that case ChatGPT. Okay, so what we need to do is just go into chatgpt.com and create an account and you you can create the blog easy as that. Okay, just go here and you just need to put the blog uh, in the prompt, create a blog about and then in here is what I want to stop because I want you to add more value in that prompt. It's just not to create a blog that you can easily get like a thousand, two thousand words, okay, for that blog. It's also giving information to ChatGPT to improve the quality of that blog, okay? What is the blog for? So in terms of to improve your SEO for your website, okay, you can put blogs. That blogs is targeting keywords that those keywords are engagement more uh, for your traffic in your website, okay? So saying that, I'm using this tool, it's called SEMrush. I know that tool is not for free. It has a free version, but you no know, a trial that you can use, okay? Um, but it's plenty of those. You just need to go and search for keywords overview or tools, keywords or SEO tools that you can find. But I'm using that one, it's called SEMrush, okay? And you have an option here down below, it says keyword overview, okay? Keyword research. For that, what I'm going to do is, okay, if I want to create a blog, I want to see what keywords and relation variation questions, no, that it pull, uh, it can help me to increase that value of the blog. Okay, so for instance, if I want to create a blog about website design, okay, and also I'm just gonna go here and say what's the location. Okay, I'm gonna put because I'm in Sydney, so okay, so I just put Sydney, Australia, but depends where you are, if you're in Europe, US, or wherever you are, you just put the location in here, right? And I'm gonna see or find um, information about this keyword, website design. Okay, so I'm just going here, search, and as you can see, give you metrics in relation to that keyword, okay? So it's just not, I'm gonna go here to ChatGPT and create a blog and say, hey, create a blog. You just need to put more value. That value, it will increase the traffic of your website as well, okay? So saying that, you go here, you can see keywords variation. You got 55,000 keywords variation that you can use to add that into you. Obviously, you are not gonna put 55,000, but you can just go and see which ones are the have more volume, okay? That's the com um, the competition, which is pretty high, okay? But you can use less volume, easy competition, okay? So that will help you to target those keywords, okay? And as you can see here, also include questions, so you can go and add those questions to that blog, okay? So saying that, even related keyword. Saying that, you know, I'm just going to probably go to see what variations do we have, okay? And those keywords, I'm going to add them into the blog. So for that, it will, um, you know, improving the, info, the, the the value of the blog. Saying that, I'm going back to ChatGPT. Here you say create a blog, for instance, all right, about website design. So I'm just going to copy that. Um, sorry, I'm just going to copy that uh, keyword, okay? Website design and include keywords, uh, variations, as, and then I'm gonna put few of those, okay? So for instance, you can put here, uh, website designer near me, okay? Uh, I'm gonna also put, uh, what else we have here? It's another thing, you can also extract or export all these, right? That is a little bit too much, but you can export, um, you can also mark them. You can export those um, keywords, okay? So you can export that as a CSV, go to ChatGPT, add attach the file, okay? And then also, let me reduce that in here. Uh, let me, okay, reset in here, sorry, reset. Okay, you can also add from computer and then you can put that CSV, okay? So that you put more value for that blog. You can also obviously put a greater blog about 2000 uh, words if you want, okay? About, um, about website design, including keywords variation as website design, website um, design in Sydney, include you can also put more like as i said here you know you're going back 
and I'm gonna see what I have in here, these questions, okay? So question, it will be how to design a website. And maybe we can also add, add uh, um, numbers and graphics if you want, okay? So that it will be a good prompt. With that, with all of this information that we give that to ChatGPT is analyzing as you can see here and it's gonna get a nice block okay that now obviously we need to go through and then see how we can put that value into your website okay um so with that it's simple as, as you can see why website design mirrors you have information in here key elements that thing can go through your website obviously you need to put a, a seo titles and meta descriptions as well which is i'm going to show you here but that it will be a way you can create a blog using chat gpt in a second that it will be good for you seo for your website okay with all of that now you just need to go and um, you go down here and copy all this information as you can see i said 2000 words and look at this, all this information is so valuable to put that into your blog for your website, okay? So you can target that keywords. Um, once it's done, you will need to go through your website. If you don't have a website, I explain, I have a tutorial on how to create a website from the, start, from, from the scratch using WordPress and Elementor Pro that you can see my channel. I put the link here. Um, and then that's it. So as you can see, it keeps going. It takes a little bit of seconds, but look, it's, 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 it's a magnificent block that you have a lot of information in here, okay? So with that, you can put that into, obviously, I'll probably add some uh, information. You can go and see that is all good. I'm going to my website. You go in here, it's simple as going, and as you can see at the top, you got add new, post, and now I'm just gonna go here and paste it, okay? Obviously, it will be a lot of things that you need to go through and see if that makes sense, but all this quality block in here, we create a block in a second, okay? So that it will help you a lot to improve your SEO for your website. In that case, what I'm going to do is here, going back and say, create a title, an SEO title and meta description for that block okay and it giving me here expert web design which is fine and then meta description all of that so i'm just gonna go here that is too long sometimes it's not good expert web design and going back and that's the meta description that if you want to know more how to do that with rank math is a seo plugin that i'm using in here so it's just basically going here on the right I hope you can see right, rank math. And I'm gonna put the keyword focus. It will be, one second, I just wanna go back here. And not that, it will be the description, meta description. And that it will be for me, the title, okay? So I'm just gonna, okay, that's fine. And um, probably I'm just gonna add website design in Simni, okay? So with that, it will be, it will be a good block that now we can have here that is too much so you just need to cut this a little bit but it's fine a website designer near me in this in there for business okay so you can put that and it will cover what the length uh, of that meta description okay you can also generate that with ai as well but i prefer to do it here and make sure that it's all good that's it i'm just going to copy that website design going focus keyword uh keyword and then you can just copy in here okay as you can see it gives you information on how to what is things missing okay you can go through but that's the purpose of this video is just how to create a blog with chat gpt and then just go in here publish obviously we need to put categories and things like that but this is how simple and easily is to create a blog using artificial intelligence today okay so now i'm just going to see how that displays in Elementor, okay? And if I'm happy, I just need to already publish, but if I'm happy, I can just uh, see one thing in here, uh, full Elementor width. And um, yeah, so that's it. So this is what it looks like. I already have here my blog. Obviously you need to edit that and give some 
uh, format. Okay, please let me know if you have any questions in the comments below. Like and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you in the next video.